What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name's Ashley. Today's video is another try on haul, which seems to be my specialty at this point. So today's haul is a bikini haul from Cupshe. I had never shopped from Cupshe before, being 100% transparent. So we're really gonna see how they fit, how they feel. So I just picked the ones I thought were cute. I grabbed a bunch of different styles. So you guys could see like some of the different styles and how they differ from each other. I, oh my God, this lighting. Okay, hopefully sitting over here combats the horrible lighting behind me. But we don't have to worry about that anymore in like seven days when I move in. So stay tuned for that. I will be having a series of move-in vlogs and room transformations. So don't forget to turn on notifications and be ready for that. Anyways, back to our haul, sorry. All the cup sheet bikinis come in these transparent packaging. Shipping was also super quick. I noticed that it took under, I'd say under a week and a half and they were here, which was super nice because sometimes I've ordered from places that it can take upwards to a month to get here. And who has the time? Summer's halfway over by then. The first bikini that I will be showing you is the hit summer striped bikini. So it's a triangle top in the front and it has these cute like crisscrosses in the back. It's non adjustable, it's one size. And if you've watched my other bikini hauls, I'm large and in charge. All the swimsuits I order, or a majority of them, are always a large. So you already know this is a large. Um, if you haven't watched my bikini video, I will link one of them up above. I will also link a second one that I did for Zaffle um, at the end. So pick your poison, but support my dreams. There's no wiring, it's just padding. The bottoms are pretty full coverage. So it's the navy blue stripe, these are also a large. Full coverage. They might be a little high waisted too, they look like they're a, or a high rise fit. The bottoms are super stretchy. The material feels nice. It's not like too thin. Let's go try it on. Okay, this actually fits very well. The bottoms are high rise. The top, even though it's not adjustable, it is super stretchy. The only negative thing I really have to say is that there's a little bit of gaping on the side. It's not like too noticeable. The back is super cute. I really like the crisscross in the back. I don't have anything really like that, which is nice. The bottoms are pretty much full coverage. I'm actually pleasantly surprised with how much I like this one. Next up, we have the Bay of Angels crochet bikini. And guys, when I saw this on the model online, I thought it was stunning. Like it's so pretty. This one I did get in a medium because I heard um, a lot of the reviews said that it ran a little large. Here's what the top looks like. There's no padding, or there's no wiring, just the padding. But come on, you guys. Come on. It has like a metal clasp as the back, which I like because I feel like it's more secure, which is good. This one is adjustable, too. The padding is thick. I'm curious to see how see-through it is with it being a crochet knit. And the bottoms. I think these ones might be a little bit more cheeky. Obviously, there's like a string side, but these ones also are super stretchy. Again, I'm a little nervous about the transparency of the bottoms, but it doesn't look that bad. Like, you can't see my hand really through it. That's pretty much my only test. Like if I hold it up in the sun and I can see it, I'm like, uh, mayday. But I don't know, this looks good. We'll try it. Okay, keeping it real with y'all. This is stunning. Like, I love this one. But I definitely think if you have a larger chest and you want support, this is not it. Like, look how pretty the color is. It makes me look so tan. I thought these strings would like cut into me more, but it's really not bad. The bottoms are a little bit more cheeky than the other one, but still a lot of coverage. 
I really like how simple the back is, just with the plain straps. It's nice that you can, you can adjust them a lot too, which is nice, but there is a little bit of side boob action. Yeah, I really like this one. Next is a reversible bikini. So we'll start with the floral side. So this one is in a size large. Um, it has a tie front, there's no tie in the back, which I think the colors of this bikini are beautiful. Like I really like the watercolor flowers on it. It's so summery, we love that. There's a crisscross in the back. It is adjustable and the material is so thick. I love it. The padding's nice. It doesn't, I don't think it would be see-through because there's a print on the other side, so like who would do that? This is so pretty. <laughs> I'm just like, oh my God. Bottoms are the same pattern. Super stretchy, super thick material. I think they're gonna be a little cheeky, but again, I think a lot of cup cheese bikinis seem to be really good on coverage. So if you need a bikini that's a little bit more modest or you don't really like to show a lot off, these are really, really good options. Because even the ones that do are a little cheeky, it's totally tasteful. The other side is, I think, it's, I think this is black. It's a black and white stripe. However, I will say that the white side definitely still shows through because the string is that flower print and the back, the crisscrosses, are also that flower print. Another detail I think that's worth mentioning is that the straps are removable. So that's really nice because if you don't like the crisscross, you can have them just straight up and down your shoulders. Which I think that would be actually really nice if you're tanning in this bikini so you don't have a line in the back. The bottoms are just the plain, the plain striped. So I will try on the floral side first and show you guys what it looks like and then I will do the striped side next. This is so pretty. I really like that you can't really see the lining of the striped. And it's super supportive. Like the back is so nice. The, everything is covered and in check in the front. It is a little bit of a high rise bikini, not high waisted, but it just goes up a little higher. Which again, if you're looking for something a little bit more modest, this is definitely a good one. And the colors are gorgeous, you guys. Okay, like I said, you can see a little bit of the floral side on the striped side. Um, just in this little detailing in the front and the straps. I do, however, notice that you can see a little bit more of the, the lining on this side from the, the floral side. It kind of stands out a little bit more, so keep that in mind. But I think this side is super cute as well. It's the same kind of fit. I just wanted to show both sides. I don't usually wear stripes, but I think this is super cute. And I think having the floral side, like detailing, I think it kind of adds to it and makes it a little less like just straight lines. And last but not least is the Hawaii Sunrise Falbala bikini set. I got this one because I don't really wear yellow because I'm blonde, but I went like super platinum, so I was thinking maybe it would look good now that I'm not so, like a, a dirty blonde. But it's like a mustard yellow color, and it wraps around in the front. So it's just one strip in the back, and then the cups come together in the front, like so. And these crisscross around the body and tie in the back. I also don't wear a lot of ruffles or like girly stuff like that. But, like I said, I like to get a lot of different styles for people who may like that and want to see it on the body. Help a girl out. Adjustable straps, no underwiring, just the padding. Material is super, super thick again. It doesn't have as much stretch, I will say that. Um, it has some. I think it really just depends on how, how tight you tie it from the front to the back that's gonna determine your fit. Also, just to uh, state once again, this is a large. The top and the bottom is a large. The bottoms are a tie bikini, which is nice because it's adjustable to you. Also, the yellow color 
I'm not sure on the fit. I think it's gonna be borderline full coverage. It's definitely not see-through, and the material is really nice. So that's good. So I think the yellow doesn't really look bad at all, even being blonde. The bottoms fit really well. They're not really high-rise, they just sit right at the, the waistline, which is nice. Ties on the side. The ruffles are a very feminine touch. I think it's nice with the crisscross, honestly. It was a little weird to put this on. You have to put it on kind of like you're putting a vest on. So that was a little weird, but I don't know. I think it looks super cute. The cross is nice. It's just enough cleavage. Nothing's like popping out anywhere on the sides. The ties in the back. Again, I think the fit on this bikini is going to determine like how tight you tie it. Like if you want it to be more cleavage, tie it tighter. If you don't, like you like the little bit of separation, it's really your call. I definitely think that this is a cute bikini and I will probably just be ordering it in a smaller size for my own personal preference. All right, that was the last bikini I had for you guys today. If you liked any of those bikinis or are interested in seeing any more from Cupshe, I will link their website in the description box below, as well as my discount code for 10% additionally off your order, which is YT3Ashley. So it kind of rhymes, but I will also link it below if you cannot remember that, because I could never remember that. The 10% off does have a minimum of $70. However, there's also a sale going on on Cupshe, 50% off all clearance. So there are a ton of options, and I hope that you liked this video enough to go check them out. Again, just an overview, Cupshe seems to have really good shipping. Their customer service is great, phenomenal. I haven't had any issues with them ever. And their bikini styles are a little bit more full coverage to medium coverage, so nothing too small, tasteful, something you can wear around your family or on a group vacation. So that's really nice because a lot of bikini companies nowadays like to have smaller bottoms or smaller tops or no padding or lack of coverage and they do a really nice job of making sure that all of those areas are covered. Thank you so much for watching. Again, I will be linking my other bikini hauls after the video so feel free to check those out. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment down below any other companies that you would like to see me try on. Don't forget to turn on notifications for my new content coming up this week and next week. You're not going to want to miss my moving haul. That's a good one. Thank you guys again and I'll see you next time.